Hello everyone. I hope this is live for you. I am having a couple of, oh hi, hello, hello. Uh, I hope this is live for you guys. I'm having a couple of tech issues this evening. So when you can see me, tell me if I click onto that. Today has not been the day. Also, I think that you're a bit grubby. Bear with. <laughs> It is just so professional around here. Um, this top is not meant to look like this. It's meant to look like this, but I've pulled it right up because when I pull the webcam down, you're gonna get a lot of like the ladies and I just feel like that's not what you've signed up for. Okay, people are saying hi. This means people are here, which is good. If you can see me and hear me say yes. <laughs> That would be, I think you're a bit rubby, me feeling caught out, yeah. Um, okay, welcome, welcome. I got really flustered just a minute ago. Hang on, I've got my phone up there. <clears throat> because I basically, I'm watching this in a different video to, in a different screen setup to what you're watching like YouTube front of house and I'm like behind the scenes and my screen looks very different from when you watch a live and I shut that tab and then I couldn't get back into it. I was like, oh my God, I can't end the stream because I've got the end stream, but I'll just, I'll just have to live stream forever. It'll be like that 10 hour NSPCC one again. Good, you're all saying yes. Whew. Okay, um, I'm just going to pop it on Instagram that I hear. Whilst I'm doing that, would you be so kind as to thumbs up the video? It makes a big difference. I don't actually know what the big difference is, that it makes, but it, look at that. Thank you. I can see that happening. I appreciate that. Right, let me just. I was so fucking frazzled <laughs> about two minutes ago. I was like, what am I going to do? What will I do? Right. Um, I'm just going to put, we are live. And then hopefully three or four people will come. That'd be lovely. Here we go. Bear with. We are live. Normally I have this set up before we start but with the old technical issues too busy having an absolute nervous breakdown if I'm honest with you. Today's live is going to be pretty real. Um, well, you have to keep Instagram open now while you're up playing. Someone else find that bar at the bottom really annoying. If you do can you say yes insta yes or just insta annoying or something like that because it drives me mad that it stays there for ages and you've got to constantly click out of it um oh the ironing board is back no alexandra can you see it look you can you can see it there no i refuse um rainbow shona how are you how's everyone else i'm good thank you how is everyone um as you can see i make no physical effort for these uh lives this is just how we've looked all day long. Um, Jessica says, hope you've had a good day. Um, Alexandra, okay, sorry, I saw nothing. You saw nothing, no one saw the ironing board. I have had a good day, actually. I've just been working from home, edited some bits. Um, that's really, I went for, just went for a wag. If, 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 like, if you were to cut my stomach open now, well, I don't need to say that, but if you were, there'd be a katsu curry in there. I got really weird. All I wanted to say was I've had, I've had a wag. It was really nice. And um, actually, if you cut my stomach open, it would, would it be acid and prob probably blood, not blood in my stomach, but if you cut me. Let's read some of the comments, shall we? Um, Sophie, which port are you looking forward to most in Norway? Uh, Stavanger, I like that a lot, and Helisilt. Right, um, where's your top from? You love the neckline, it's from Very. Um, I'll say Ad because I am a Very ambassador. Um, right, <laughs> I've regained myself. I would love to hear where you're all from, and I'm going to start with the crafts while you're writing where you're all from. I am starting with some bracelets today, one for Pearl and one for her little friend, Georgina, because they're coming over this week, well, Georgina's coming this week, and also the main reason is these, be I'm gonna put you down so you get a bit of table. Um, the main reason is that 
these beads don't have a box or a bag. I don't know if I put those there, you can't see anything. So I want to use them up and get rid of them. Um, we're going for elastic thread. We're not gonna do beading the whole time, we're just gonna do some quick beads. And then we're moving on to the sticker haul. And then we're doing a little gift for my sister. Um, wow, Costa Rica, Virginia, Winchester, Scotland, Colorado, Kent, Germany, um, Canterbury. Um, I'm currently crocheting a Zog Dragon. Love that for you. Right, thread, elastic thread. Can anyone remember what the correct thickness is? What is the girth we like for beading thread? If you get it right, you get nine glitter points. I'm going to put these into a rainbow pattern. How is it? What's the pattern for rainbows? Something like Richard. Richard, what the, what's the 0.8? Yes, I'm seeing M Brown, Lucy, Amelia, Pixie, Kelly, Lou, Olivia, Chloe. Um, well done. Well done. Not clever. You just said you're currently doing embroidery. You didn't actually say 0.8. Um, R O Y. R <laughs> Red, yellow, pink, green, red, yellow. Richard of York gave battle in vain. Thank you. Richard of York gave, what's B? Battle. We don't have indigo. In V. What's V? What's V? Well, why is this so violent? Why is this so hard? This is like very basic colour theory, isn't it? But here we are struggling. The struggle is real. Um, what are you all making today? I hope you're all making something. We've got someone very special on the live today. And I know that she'll cringe that I've said her. But my cousin is watching. So hello, Ellen. Um, my cousin, Ellen Pen... Oh, that's look at that. That's real nice. Um... Can everyone write hello Ellen in the comments? So Ellen is my dad's brother's daughter and everything was going pretty, and she's like at least 10 years younger than me, maybe even like 15 years younger. Everything was going quite well for me in the family, in the family, until my cousins Harry and Ellen came along because they're so clever. And for a, for a long while, I was the most clever and I was the only one with a degree and did all these things and then my like highly achieving cousins came along and just really really messed that up for me right we're gonna have to mess this up ever so slightly there we go right we're making two let's get these made I still have all of these and I have no I have no packaging or compartment for them and that really really upsets me it upsets me to push it off the mat just for the sake of the video, I've done it. And have I made this long enough? Potentially not. She's gonna be tight, that one. Um, I'm doing cross stitching. Please like the video, says Em. Yes, thanks Em, I appreciate that. Please like the video. Um, do you know what I've done? I've cut this before I'm even ready. I am not with it today. As you well know, we don't cut until the end. That's why I'm thrown. <sighs> Lily is colouring in her fairy book. A few people saying hello, Ellen, that is nice. Um, packaging orders from my pottery shop. Yeah, if you've got a small business, feel free to shout the small business out, especially if it's crafty. I mean, even if it's not crafty, shout it out if you like. Um, we're not upset about shouter outers here. Um, em, you're saying please like the video a lot. That is so kind of you, but don't worry too much. It's got loads of likes and that is lovely. Um, when you're making a bracelet, it's so much nicer when you've ordered the beads out. I think there's probably two types of bracelet makers. One that just like to pick and choose as they go. And then one, like me, that just likes to order it all out and just be very organised about it all. Um, packaging sticker orders for my Etsy. Ames, do you have a sticker business? Because you know how we feel about stickers around here. Why are you not shouting out your sticker business? And also telling us what kind of stickers you make because we we love stickers. You remember what happened last time when we saw that holographic butterfly sticker. Shit, the bed. That was a good day. Um, I'm sewing a beach dress for my friend's daughter. That is ever so nice of you. 
Um, <laughs> Louise says, we bloody love stickers. We do bloody love stickers around here. Um, finally made it to another one of these, says Lola. Hello, Lola. Um, only because you, I want to buy beads from Hobbycraft. You went to buy beads from Hobbycraft and they do a bead pick and mix. Okay, Jessica, I'm going to say something pretty strong now. I love Hobbycraft. I go to Hobbycraft quite regularly. I spend a lot of money in Hobbycraft. I think that Hobbycraft does a lovely job of being Hobbycraft. What I think Hobbycraft do not do a lovely job of is beads. I'm just going to say it. I don't understand why they do such a poor job of beads. If anyone's with me on this, I would love some solidarity. I don't understand why they do such a poor job of beads. Hang on. Is that going to be too big? No, that'll be perfect for a child. Um, they're Hobbycraft. They have access to, like, every craft. They have connections in... They have their fingers in every craft pie. They are pie fingers for crafts, and yet their bead selection is always utter garbage. I'm sorry, I've said it. I want to take the head honchos of Hobbycraft to like Joanne's and Michael's in America and be like, please, please, let me give you my money if you provide this for me. Um, yes, they have a bead pick and mix, but I don't think the bead pick and mix is a high quality, I don't think there's a high variety. I, a bead connoisseur, ha Hobbycraft, if you're listening, business trip, let's go to America, L see the bead selections there, it will blow your crafty minds, we can have a great time, we can, we can have, we, look, <laughs> I just, I'm passionate about beads and I'm passionate about Hobbycraft. Someone says uh, it's expensive. Yeah, I'm happy to pay for the beads. I'm happy. I'm happy to give you my money for beads. I had to pick my little girl up from nursery today. She was poorly. Oh, no. Um, same. Can I come and show you them paper crafting in America too? Americans just do crafts so right. They're so intense about crafts. But they have. I would be intense about crafts if I had that many supplies. Like, fucking hell that does anybody work at Hobbycraft here does anybody know anyone does anybody follow Hobbycraft uh is it Wimbledon or Wembley on um on the old TikTok it's so good currently recovering from doing a big clean of my flat Holly but I bet you feel amazing um oh hey I was just looking for the inspo to finish my diamond painting yes get going um you Holly is sat in bed cross stitching Shein is really good for beads it is and it isn't. I have bought quite a lot of beads. Oh, do you know what I will say? Shein is better than Hobbycraft for beads. Anyway, here we go. Made this. That's cute. We'll just do another quick one. And then both of the girls have had their beads bracelets done. Um, you've been to Ikea today. Oh, lovely. I do like Ikea. Well, I'll tell you what. I like the idea of Ikea. Oh, oh, oh. God. I like the idea of Ikea. Mm -mm. Oh, Miss says, American here, and I love Michaels. <sighs> Just so jealous of anyone that lives in America and has such access to such amazing crafts. I'm going to America in October, and I just think that's too far away. Like, I can't wait. I need, I need, should we do a group trip? You know, like, is it Kirsty Travels? Or there's this amazing plus-size woman who does, like, plus-size travel videos, and she arranges like group trips for plus size people to go and like have the best time. And she like plans those of like plus size friendly stuff. Could we do that? But for crafting, could we go on like a craft? Oh my God. Right. So we have this group and everyone like pays their own bit to go. Um, and someone has to arrange it. I imagine me. Pick where we're going to go. Give me the price. You pay, you book yourself on. We go as a group. And we go around various craft places. Like we go to America, we go to like Michael's, we go to Hobby Lobby, we go to Joanne's. We do all of that sort of stuff. But then also, could we go to like workshops and things? And could we like learn new craft things? And could we stay in like a really amazing, gorgeous hotels? And then they'll have the hotel will have like a lounge space, and it will all be set up, and we'll like just get our bags of craft things and just tip all our crafts all over the table and just like spread it all out and have a look and tell everyone what we're going to make with all of our craft things. 
It's all bits making me dribble, it sounds so exciting. And then we'll order loads of room service and just have all delicious American room service food and talk about crafting. I've just described heaven, basically. That is nice. La la la. Project Craft Runway. Is this like a TV show or are you naming our craft trip? Um, I feel like your brain is a fizz of exciting craft ideas. It is. Sorry I'm reading so slowly. I've got you quite far away and my eyes are not good. Um, can we collect Marie en route? Yes. Shall we just go to Seattle, which is where she's from? Um, Cherry says, I dabble in painting, drawing, scrap journaling, but I absolutely love doing diamond paintings, preferably with a good TV show to watch and a cup of tea. Oh, Cherry. <laughs> wow, that was, that was saucy. Um, I have been... Ah, Mayday! We've got a little bug on... Why won't it die? Why, why is it still a lot? Jesus Christ. This will not be being moved from there. How is that still alive? I squashed that so many times and it's like, got an exoskeleton. Um, we do some craft classes on Iona cruise time. I went and there was a, sorry, what? I'm going on a cruise. Are there craft classes on the cruise I'm going on? If so, speak now because I, <laughs> yes, I will be doing them. Um, doing art level three in September to further my small business, says Steph does things. Oh, Steph, what's your business? Shout it out, shout it out. Um, Sophie, sorry to anyone watching with headphones. Oh, sorry. Was that very like, in your ears? Um, <laughs> you reacted to the bug and say in my word. Um, how long have you been into crafts? I can't stop myself buying new things. I've been into crafts since the day I was born. My mum was a crafter, she did craft fairs. She not only sold things at the craft fairs, but she also ran craft fairs. So we would go um, when the craft fairs were on and like take the money on the door and like know all the crafty businesses. Basically my mum was the original 1980s and 1990s Etsy is what she was. Um, so yeah, just forever basically. Oh my God, the craft pen pal idea. What is this? I've missed it. What is the craft pen pal idea? Obviously, I need to know about this. Um, Sophie, I started my pot pottery as a hobby since becoming disabled, but I used to paint. Um, Steph, called Steph Crafty Corner. Okay, but Steph, what does your Crafty Corner do? You want to know more? Um, your videos are so freaking comforting. Oh, thank you. I think it's because of your British accent. It's so soothing. Thank you. Um, watching with my eight day old. Oh, Kira, well done. You've just, you've either pushed a baby, thank you, Fanny, or you've had it lifted out the sunroof. Well done. Well done. Cute notification. Bear with. Bear with. You are like, YouTube just let me know I'm live. Oh, I know, I know. Right, that's both of those done and dusted. Kippers and custard. Snip off the edge with my scissors. Snip off the edge. Look at that. That is lovely. Georgina is going to love that. Find a little simple bracelet. Almost warms us up, doesn't it? Done. My bracelet's done. My bracelet's put my strings in the bin. In the bin. Right. Would we like to have the rest of the sticker haul from last week? If so, oh look, you can see the sodding iron. And not only can you see the ironing board, that is the cord for the iron. Um, if you would like to see, if you would like to see the rest of the sticker haul, oh, I cannot move you. Okay, come on, just moving the bug. Well, come on then. Now I'm trying not to trap its stupid little legs. Um, I think you know the answer to this, my love. Sticker haul all the way. That's from Matthew. Um, Harriet Palman, we want stickers. Um, yes, stickers. Do you plan on having a whole craft room built? No, I don't. Happy to send stickers from Michaels if you need some. Oh, don't tease me. I want to, oh God, I just want to go and choose all the stickers. Um, stickers, stickers, stickers. Yes, please, stickers. Yes, stickers. Oh, yes, stickers. 
Okay. Uh, what are the, these guys I've got out from last week? Remember we had some moons? Uh, don't worry though, because I have been organising the stickers today and they will go in what I like to call my celestial uh, box. Celestial. Celestial. Luna. This is the box for those. I don't think these have sticky back. Let's not start this again. We all remember when I found the sticky back last time, just as I read someone's comment that their grand had died, which was awkward. Okay, first up, these. They are roses. They are plants. They are nature. They are delicate. They are romantic. They are sensational. We're going to open these. Imagine you selling craft sets. Love to sell craft sets. I'm headed to Japan soon. I'm planning to get so many stickers and so much stationery. Oh, Amy. Oh, God, you're going to have a lovely time. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. These are nice. Let me just. Where can I. Oh, it's not just rose, it's bouquets. It's bouquets. Oh, God, sweet mercy. Look at them. Just look. Very happy, and they, some of them are roses. Look, very, very happy with these. These are going to go in our nature case, which is this one. And here we've got butterflies, we've got the daisies, and we've got the eucalyptus. Um, own your own stationery line. I would love to own my own. Oh, look, when you put them in, they're just it's making me dribble. I'm so about to be about these stickers. I think probably next week, if we do one next week, we'll have to do something using the stickers. I just love that I own this. This is in my house. That's really nice. Okay, so well, lovely. Uh, next, there's, there's some other craft bits. These beads, not sure about them. I bought these, I ordered these when the Little Mermaid came out and I was feeling a bit excited about Little Mermaid themed things. Now, I've got an escapee, naughty little bugger, pop you in there, lovely. Okay, next up, these I don't think are stickers. The reason your internet is cutting off. Oh, don't say that. Um, Shirley says, so sad, paper chase clothes, me too. Um, I'm not sure if these are stickers or little scrapbooky bits. Um, but, so it looks like this, like little doilies, you know. Let's have a look. Um, who does your nails, please? My friend Chloe does my nails. She is wonderful. Oh, this is a sticker. Boys and girls, she is a sticker. Nice, nice, okay. Good know. And this isn't shiny, this is matte. <sighs> Stop it. Look, there's some ones that are just bits. Oh, happy day. We don't have a department for these. Maybe we'll have to make a department. Although I did have one for vintage, but I think these need to go in like something else. What department would we call this? Would we call it like scrapbooking? You let me know. Oh, look at us all talking about paper chase. RIP paper chase. Will it ever come back? Oh, sad times. Sad times. Okay, next up. Well, this. This looks a little bit enticing. Um, scrapbooking. Yeah, we're thinking put that in a little box called scrapbooking. First of all, first of all, first things first on the realist. Second thing second, I can never do. Oh my god. Sorry. Is it a jam jar full of tiny stickers? No, it's just stickers, but it looks. That's adorable. That is adorable. That is just adorable. Um, Claire says, bloody hell, that's adorable. Yeah, you're right. I don't even, I mean, these stickers, when I make, uh, look, oh, oh, God. It's not okay for stickers to bring a 38 year old this much joy. Maybe if I just hold them, look. There's some cats in there. There's a lollipop. There's some stars. It's very Hello Kitty, isn't it? But not Hello Kitty. Like, Hello, Catty. Um, I'm loving the weeklies and the videos lately. Oh, thank you. Um, uh, where are your stickers from? I got these from Shein 
Um, but also Amazon, I don't want to take them off. I don't want to, you can't make me, I'm not going to. These will be the stickers that I never use because they are just so fucking lovely. Um, I've also got a link below to my Amazon storefront and there are a lot of stickers on there. Um, do you like Kiki K from Alexandra Barnes? Yes, they used to have a shop in Covent Garden, then it went. Where is Kiki K? That's what I would like to know. I'll stop this. Guys, it's moons, but it's also holographic butterflies. And you know how I feel about holographic things. You know how I feel about holographic. Okay. Because of the message, me, but also holographic stickers. <laughs> okay, um, just a quickie. Ellen is halfway through the globe. She's done a globe. Here it is. That's what my cousin's made. Love that. She's going to do a sparkly plane on it. Um, okay. <laughs> oh, God. It's made me laugh. Salivate. These are holographic globes. Oh, my God. It's a moon with a flower and a butterfly at the same time. Okay, that one's not holographic, but it's got shinies on it. It's got the shinies. So that is good. And I'm sure I saw some holographic. It... <laughs> <laughs> not just shiny. Hang on, let me get it in the right light. Why, won't, why can't it? It's holographic. Do my eyes see me no. What if I do it from... I will move. The ring. You can see it. I know you can see it. You can see that, can't you? It's holographic. It is a planet. It is floral. It is butterflies. It's shiny. It's holographic. Just let's just take a moment for this. Look. Okay. Still pretty. These are pretty. Can't see it. Who? Who can't see it? Look that that is just so joyful that is so joyful there's so many of this sort stop it absolutely stop it oh my god look at them uh, this one that I thought was just a shiny misrepresented it's not just a shiny it's also a holographic why bother doing any other sticker now that I've seen these um the excitement is bringing me so much joy um you need them i love shattered glass holographics so pretty um cast says sick yes that's what the young people say they, these are sick they are sick i don't i don't know where to put i'm wondering if maybe i've made an error by putting the butterflies a holographic butterfly do you want to see a holographic butterfly from last week if you missed it we got these. I've already used some of these. I think we can all agree they're the greatest sticker that you've ever seen in your entire life. Um, uh, God, sorry, I can't even talk. I think that these shouldn't be in the nature box, frankly. I think that these need to come out and there needs to be an elite holographic box um, for these, should I be sorting these out now? No, not on the freaking live. People are waiting for more entertainment. This is not the entertainment that people signed up for. Um, okay, oh, steady, steady, steady. Thought we had a stir away. No, it's fine. I think that it needs its own box. Um, can we have one of the girls, can we have one of the girls as a special guest one time? Um, no, not on the lives. I don't think that's a lot of pressure for a child to be live um whenever i film them i tell them that i'm filming and then i edit quite heavily because you never know what a child's gonna say and i just quite careful with what goes on the internet for that sort of thing um an elite box for shinies necessary okay we're making good progress we're making good progress what is this what are you This is a very small picture. Okay, when I ordered this, I thought these were postcard size. I thought I'm gonna start scrapbooking, so I bought all these like backgrounds, you know? Well, oh yeah, so nice, so nice. Uh, but these are quite small, but it's not the size of the scrapbooking square, it's how you use it. 
these I think is the same thing um, you should do the girls scrapbooks I should um, do the girls help you when you choose stickers no I don't want them getting involved I don't want them messing around because they'll pick things they don't like this is a very private personal choice for me this just says sticky and it's dolphins and it's sticky what will it be in the tiny box do you ever have sticker books and blank pages that you could put the stickers in and then peel off and rearrange oh i don't oh look it's a tiny box of stickers how nice is that that it's not in plastic okay what will the stickers be of place your guesses now i mean given that there's a dolphin on the box potentially a dolphin um this is adult sticker time yeah this is adult sticker time um do you like opals as in the gemstones not the sweets Yes, I do. Um, okay, these are not dolphins. They are snowflakes. Oh, is it all blue things? And we've also got some dolphins. Sure, sure. But we've also got some blue violins. What next, do you ask? Are you thinking, oh, it's obviously just an all blue packet? No, it's not. What's that? What even is that? No idea. I don't know what I was thinking. Okay. What next would you have after dolphins and um, a violin, a snowflake? What else would you have? Or oh, just a stained glass window with planets in it, obviously. There. Um, blue violins, all things blue. Okay. What next would you have? We've had a whale, a violin, stained glass window. What else would you have? What else would you have? What else would you have? It's a bird. Obviously, it's a bird. Um, these are mad. Uh, a feather. Oh, why not have a feather? Maybe these need to go in the book. Mm, a planet. I don't know what category to put these in. Do they need their own category? I can't have these. These are, stickers aren't good enough to warrant their own category. Blue things. I can't categorise by colour. Maybe they go with the scrapbooking things. Because I think that these aren't, I'm sorry, I'm gonna say it quietly, but I don't think these, these are A plus level stickers. Saying that, that would be very useful if you were scrapbooking. I feel quite despondent by the blue things. Well, I don't know what to do, but good thing is I've ordered another box of them. So let's see what's in here. Uh, this box is pink. Um, let's see, miscellaneous, maybe wedding. Someone said wedding, miscellaneous. Okay, what will these be? Will they be stickers? They are not stickers, guys. These are not stickers. Um, these are small images. <sighs> Why have I done this? It was so late when I placed my order. Okay, so here we are. This says girls, girls. Um, these are some lovely, what do you call these? Cherry blossoms. Look at all these cherry blossoms. Hang on a minute though, because these have got a texture that alludes to them being stickers. Stop it. If this is a sticker, that. It's a sticker. Okay. Now you're talking. So, what we're going to do is we're going to. These are scrapbooking stickers. We're going to get another case out for scrapbooking stickers. And because I like these, I now like the other ones. I now like the blues because I've got these to sort of complement, if you will. So I'm sorry I was so down on you. And then I'll put these in here. And now we've got a little scrapbooking. So, oh, yes, this is all. Come on. Oh, careful. I almost forgot this trombone. Is that a trombone? What is this? This is not a trombone. A trombone is like, rah, 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 isn't it? What's that? Cello? Something like that? Someone will know. Oh, I love them. Perfect for scrapbooking, says Lola. Yes, that's right. Um, these are some beads I bought. These, this was a mistake. I think I probably thought these were a lot bigger. They are small and not many. So they go over. Oh, stop it. Didn't know they were there. Um, have I shown you the book? The book of many postcards? Yes, I can go in there, although it's not a sticker. Are they stickers? <laughs> Guys, are these going to be stickers? I 
these are going to be stickers. We're going to be excited. Well, I can't tell. Are they a sticker or are they just paper? You know what, guys? I've got, oh, I was going to say I've got a degree, but it's not as anyone. It's a sticker. It's a sticker. In that case, yes, you can go in the uh, sticker drawer there. Um, we've got another one of those. Did I order two of the same? No. I'm so annoyed at myself. I've been completely influenced by you, Louise, and need to go and order 1,000 stickers. Yes. I think you do. Um, more little postcards, but this time a green theme for when I do my forest themed scrapbooking, which I am going to do daily. I have never done scrapbooking in my life, but now I am going to. And there's nothing you can do to stop me. Um, these seem to be signposts because I obviously thought, oh, I'll have to have those for my scrapbooking project. Let's just, you know what, we don't need to tip these all out. Oh, are they signposts or are they motivational messages? Love from our parents and friends. What am I going to do with that? My mum's dead. That would be really weird if she sent love from our parents. Love from my dead mum. Also need to care for nature. I mean, that's, that's not, not true, is it? Forget everything and start from the heart. This one says, guess what it says actually, just guess what it says. Uh, I'll give you the first bit. As strong as a, what, what does this suggest that you are as strong as? Um, very motivational. <laughs> um, people are feeling very. Um, oh, um, as strong as a woman, a girl, an elephant, an ox. No, but ox would be. I would like ox. Um, live, laugh, lactose intolerant. As strong as a storm. As strong as a woman. Lion, rock, rock. Dance like no one's watching. A whale. As strong as a whale. Uh, as as strong as a tree. Jessica Louise Wall, you are close. Uh, a bird, a yeti, a mother. Um, <laughs> tree is the closest we've got for a horse. Uh, tequila, leaf, leaf, not leaf, not leaf. Flower, flower, twig, <laughs> branch, leaf. If anybody gets this, you, you've won. You have won. Houseplant, a trombone, branch, stem, grass. Come on, it is. It's another word for a type of tree, and it's not like a breed of tree or a brand of tree. What do you call tree types? Uh, stump, feather, oak, roots, petal, ox, plant, willow, branch, oak, tree, root, log, shrub, bush, tree, sprig, hedge, shrub. We still, still haven't got it. Christmas, bush, uh, willow, trunk, trunk, Christmas. Come on, it's, it's, it's not, it's, it's, uh, if I tell you, it's a, uh, wood. it's a type of tree. Sapling! 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 Who says Jessica? Sapling. As strong as a sapling. <laughs> what the fuck? Why would you ever write Saplings are so weak, aren't they? They're so small and bendy. <laughs> Saplings have to have sticks to help them up. They have to have like wooden structures. They have to have scaffolding to keep them up. Otherwise they're like, mm, just a sapling. as strong as a sapling. What an insult. What a fucking insult. What is a sapling? It's a baby tree <laughs> sapling. <laughs> These are brilliant. I dare not look at what the rest of them say, but we will. Um, this one, this one, if you wanted something very, very motivational, this one will, I hope, I hope you're all sitting down because this is motivational. So you could have um, love from our parents and friends, forget everything, Start from the heart. You are as strong as a sapling. Northwest. <laughs> this one says, these are all in the same packet. I don't know what they're advertised as, but I wouldn't have bought these. <laughs> this one says, London and Northeastern Railway. <laughs> what? 
why why is that in with also care for nature why are they all together okay um to london road if you need to go to london road and then <laughs> we've got We've got some one-worders here, which I really think give a certain je ne sais quoi. Okay, so we'll go for three of them. The first one is just simply outdoor. Outdoor. Perhaps I could team that with some of my, like, mini nature postcards. I think that would look nice together. Hang on. Nice. Outdoor. Okay. The next one, if I just wanted a bit of positive affirmations or reaffirmation, cool. Cool. But then, if I really wanted to describe myself, fragile. They are going in the... I had a box of motivational words. Steady on, Bridget. Where are they? Oh, for goodness sake. Oh, they're in here. They are in here. I have put those in, but you're not going in there because you're too good for the words. Um, so they'll go in here from these. Fragile as a sapling. Yeah, that's right. So the words are going in there. <laughs> I need to hurry this up. Does everybody like the pace we're going at? These, I think, are going to bring it all in. Let's have a little sip. Is anyone having any snacks? Mm. Jessica says we need this every week. I can't do this every week because mm, when the girls go back to school, I have to do, like, clubs and things with them. It's just my summer holidays. Um, immediately need an Instagram post with one of these as a caption. Strong. If I put it in at some point this week, you'll know where it's come from. Right. Oh, lovely. These have come in some sort of what? What? What would you call this? I want to call it vellum. Is this like tracing paper? It's like tracing. Is this called vellum? Oh, that is nice, isn't it? That is classy. It's got some gold foiling on, and it says flowers and dreams. <sighs> Already I'm excited. It says flowers and dreams. Nice. Nice. Um, oh, Bethan is enjoying some garlic bread. That is nice. A sachet. Melina says it's a sachet. Yeah, I'm going to tell you a funny story about the word sachet. Pause, please. My friend, Tony, is the smartest woman I know. She was my friend at university. She still is my friend, but we met at university and we were great friends. And she was the cleverest out of all of us. There were seven of us. We were called the Fabcan Girlies. And she was so clever. She went, she's because she's a doctor now. She's that clever. She's a doctor. One day she rang me and she was reading some instructions and she was struggling because she couldn't work out what the sachet was. She was like, what is the sachet? There's no sachet in here. Does it mean satchel? I was like, Tony, it means sachet. So every time someone writes sachet. Right, hopefully it's not full of dolphins. Well, hope not. It's not holographic but they are shiny and bringing. She's nice. Hang on. That's nice. That's nice. That's a classy sticker. That's like wedding invitation level nice. That is nice. Oh, look at her, 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 look at her. Very happy with those. Um, should now, the question is, Someone's dogs barking. Do I go? Do I put them in the nature doodah or do I put them in the elite holographic? No, they can't go the holographic because they're not holographic. You are good, but you are not holographic. Sorry. Sometimes you have to make tough decisions. You're all good. Oh, you're not all gold. That one's white. That's lovely. Yeah, I made the right call. They can't all go in the holographic. If you're not holographic, you can't go in the holographic. You can't go in the holographic box. It's very simple. Um, create a wedding one. Yes. Uh, shiny. Um, you need friends to phone up when you need a hand with a sachet. Uh, oh, God. I'm really struggling to read this. Have you watched Heartstopper? No. No, I haven't. Don't know what it is. Feel free to tell me about it. I think these might be our last two things. <gasps> no. Right. These, I think I bought these with the children in mind. I thought these ones might be ones that Darcy would like. This is very intense. These are, yeah, I bought these. I thought my kids would like them. They are cats. <laughs> it's 
cat with headphones on. I am not a fan of this sort of sticker, but my children will absolutely love this sort of sticker. I'll just see a little close up. That sort of thing. And I did put together a stickers the children would like box earlier. Um, ever try to get furry stickers? No, I don't want furry stickers. And um, all the puffy ones. The puffy ones, I hate puffy stickers. I don't really like, uh, because the problem with a puffy sticker is if you use it in a book, then your pages don't sit flat. A furry one I could cope with. I could get away with a furry one. But a puffy one, no, it's not for me. I don't like them at all. They also fall apart quite quickly. It's just, no, it's a strong, no, but thank you. Um, these, again, I think I thought that my children would like these. Oh, that's a bit weird. I'm gonna throw that one away. I don't like that one. Um, what did I think I would like these? They're all like gems. I think I bought these thinking I would like these. They're gems, but they're not kind of, I wanted them to be shiny. They're not shiny, they're matte. They're okay. They're okay. They're okay for scrapbooking. Perhaps we'll put them in the scrapbooking jobby here. Or should I put them in the ones my children might like? I could pick out some that I like. I'm going to go through these later. Okay. Last in our haul before we try one more thing. Is this, oh no, there's not going to be time. Look at the time. Oh, look at the time. We'll have to do our little um, art project thing later or another time. What will this be? Do we think, well, it looks like a little bottom, doesn't it? Hello. Um, do we think that this will be stickers or mini postcards that are also stickers? Essentially, it's all going to be stickers, but do we think they're going to be like those blue whales and violins? Or do we think they're going to be mini postcards? Any postcards or stickers? Mini postcards or stickers? Mini postcards or stickers? Many postcards are stickers. Shirley says it goes too fast. Ella says postcards. Um, postcards, postcards, more motivational stickers, doll's house poster stickers, postcards, stickers from Hayley. It's mini postcards, guys. It's mini postcards which are also these. Is it just me? Or are these a little bit? Suggestive, a juicy cut in half fruit and a and a are these adult stickers. No, no, they're not. And that's a vase. No, they're not adult stickers. They're fine, they're nice, that's okay, they're pink. Lovely, lovely jubbly. I think if we do this next week, we should do some scrapbooking, shouldn't we? Um Matthew says all oh, spicy. Um I think we can all agree that the highlight was these and our elite holographic ones. These are the best. Um, what have you all been making whilst I've been slowly <laughs> losing the plot over stickers? Have you completed any of your projects? Cousin Ellen, if you're watching, send, send us an update. How or not? Um, let me know. Ella says, I love a laundry, you'd love a laundry segment live, <laughs> maybe one day. Um, did you know that I posted a weekly um, on Sunday? If you haven't watched it, go and watch it, I think you'll like it. Um, just been too busy staring at your stickers, the highlights were the quotes. Yeah, the highlights were the quotes actually, I mean, Northwest. Um, I just walked the dog, so I missed it, says Joe. Don't worry, this will be uploaded and you can, if you want to watch it back, you can. I wouldn't. I wouldn't watch a live back because I think I can't imagine why I would want to watch this hour of like chaotic sticker mess. Uh, but I've enjoyed doing it. Um, drawing in my reverse colouring book, well done. Just been planning what to make for my sister's 60th birthday card. And let's see what well, she's made. Oh, very nice. She says the gold glitter isn't showing up very well, but it's shining. Oh, that is nice. So her friends are going away and she has made this for them. Oh god, I hope her friends aren't watching. <laughs> Surprise! Alan's made you something lovely. That's really nice, Alan. I love that. Um, thank you all so much for coming to this live. There'll be a new video from me either on Wednesday or Thursday. I think probably Wednesday and also Sunday. So make sure you're subscribed. Make sure you hit the thumbs up button. Share the videos. All that stuff that people ask you to do. It just is really helpful. Um, oh, finish the strawberry on my tablecloth from Hannah. 
All right, thanks ever so much, everyone. I've really enjoyed this. I will love you and leave you and tidy up this mess. I'll see you all soon. Thanks for watching. Bye.